Lawyers for former President Trump say his efforts to secure a five, excuse me, a $454 million bond have been rejected by more than 30 underwriters. Trump needs to post that bond so he can appeal a New York State civil fraud judgment that he's now facing. CBS News' Christina Fan is live in the newsroom with more. Christina. Mary and Chris, good morning. The former president is running out of time. He has just six days to obtain a nearly half a billion dollar bond, which his attorneys called grossly disproportional to the offenses he was found liable for. In a court filing, Trump's lawyers revealed he has been unable to secure the money despite approaching about 30 bond companies. His attorneys are asking the appeals court to pause the judgment while he appeals the civil fraud case. Back in February, a judge ordered ordered Trump to pay $454 million after finding him liable for doing a decade's worth of business with fraudulent financial statements that overvalued his real estate holdings and wealth. If the appeals court does not intervene, Attorney General Letitia James, who brought on the lawsuit, can seek to enforce the judgment starting March 25th. That is just a week away. And if Trump cannot pay, the Attorney General could freeze his bank accounts or seize his properties, including Trump Tower and 40 Wall Street. In the newsroom, Christina Fan, CBS 2 News. Christina, thank you.